So today we're gonna to talk about your iPhone keyboard and how to make it better. Follow these tips and uh, hopefully it becomes a lot easier to use your keyboard and you learn a couple things along the way, maybe. Let's change a few things in settings. Go in settings, general, go down to keyboard. So if you happen to speak more than one language, right? You could go into your keyboard, have that option there to add a language. Got all this to choose from and hopefully that list expands and starts to include Japanese. That'd be nice, but not yet. So for now, let's do sure, Portuguese. So if I open up a note here, you'll see when I go to my keyboard, I'll now have this English, US and Portuguese option. So I actually ended up changing this to Spanish because I don't know Portuguese and I don't know Spanish, but I know more Spanish than I do Portuguese. It understands and I can just be like, I don't know Spanish. Multilingualness. Next thing in your settings list, you're gonna see text replacement. This I use daily. It kind of shortcuts for different links or whatever you wanna do. That's what she said. That's what she said. And you'll see here, Typing T-W-S-S -S gets you, that's what she said. That's what she said, space. So useful, I encourage you to make a bunch of them. Next, you're gonna see one-handed mode. I don't know why it's here. You can also easily access it, holding down the globe or the emoji face. If you're gonna see that, those two, okay? That puts it this way, that puts it that way, and that puts it back. Very nice, especially if you're, you know, on the toilet. You're like, hey, I'm pooping. These are just kind of things that most people I feel like will use, but some people really, really hate a lot of this. Like I know a lot of people don't like autocorrect. You're trying to type, you know, something, you get that. You don't want to be in a fight and have that pop up. You just don't. You can always turn off. So I don't know who would disable caps lock, uh, but if you want to know how to do it, you just double tap here. For whatever reason you don't want that, I guess you could just turn it off in that setting, but um, that's that's really strange of you. Then there's this, the full stop shortcut. So if you don't know what this is, when you're at the end of a sentence, if you double push spacebar, you get an automatic full stop. If you don't want that, you turn it off, you can as much as you want. That's about it for the settings section. So now we're just gonna go straight into just some general tips. First off, you should know this, but if you don't, hold down spacebar, Go like that and you can actually click like a mouse while you're holding touch again and there you go you can select things it's kind of hard to deselect them but now an easier way to select everything as long as it's in the same paragraph just one two three and you'll select let's see here the second you push return and i try again one, two three only gets that if you want to select one word double tap what if you accidentally erase it oh no no well you could shake your phone that doesn't look great in public three finger time swipe left undo swipe right redo pinch in cut and then pinch out paste if you're in the middle of typing and you don't want to you know keep pushing this to go back to the numbers hold down the numbers type your numbers let go if you ever needed different currency and this works with a lot of the keys on here you can hold down the key here you get Different currency, the only way to select all. One finger, touch, select all. Now you have mastered the Apple keyboard. I hope that makes things a little bit easier. Also note, just because you have an English and Spanish keyboard does not mean that your dictation understands English and Spanish. Like right now, hello, my name is Tyler. Does not understand both. So just keep that in mind. Hopefully in an update that'll come, but we'll see. Enjoy your keyboard, enjoy your iPhone. Hopefully those tips helped you out. And if not, go get a Samsung. Not that there's anything wrong. I'm just saying it's an iPhone, man. You want more from Apple? You're funny, but not that funny.